as a part of this story, I would love to welcome our friend Gordon from KCS onto the show as well. Gordon, thank you so much, my friend. Leo, you have been amazing. These parts behind me actually come from KCS as well. Special thanks to them. I'm going to give a quick preview, Gordon, because I've been into your facility, but I'm going to let you do all the fine tuning to this story. We're talking about a young man, Kyle who believed in himself, who believed in five-axis machining, that didn't really want to start in the three-axis world, knew the capability of his intelligence and what a Matt Sura could do. At 24 years old, a real manufacturing millennial that jumped into it right away, you partnered with him. Let's hear more about the KCS story. Well, I, you pretty much nailed it there, uh, uh, Kyle, Kyle Shapinsky. Um, sharp young guy, got a real head for programming, just a, just a gift for it and uh, immediately saw the value of five axis machine and and actually it goes deeper than that he enjoys the challenge uh, he enjoys the challenge somebody says this can't be done or that can't be done or it's too hard it, kyle's all over it and so he's grown his shop he went from um you know a small presence over the years 11 years now to um really uh doubling the size of the shop well quadrupling we doubled the size of where we are and um and so there you have it we got into um um, five axis machining was uh, our bread and butter, but got into the Maxura, Matsura machines when um, we're a small company, so we look for things, you know, it's got to be a strategic purchase. It's got to be something that fits where we're, what we're doing, what our customers want from us, and then is, is going to grow as we grow. And so Kyle and the, the fellow, the team did their homework and looked around pretty good, settled on Matsura, and it's been um, Matsura machines have worked out very well for us. We've just Picked up our third machine, and um, you know couldn't couldn't uh, say enough good things. So, you know, you mentioned these parts here. You, I'd, I'd like to tell you about them. Let's talk about a little bit about these parts. We got our cameraman zoomed in for the audience right now. Let's talk about it. Okay. Well, first, let me back up and talk. Delighted to be here. Matt Suris would invite us to um, you know feature our parts and us here. But this story really underscores the correctness of the decision that um, Kyle and the team made. And, and with regard to Matsura and, and the capabilities of, of these machines, I mean, we, we couldn't be, you know, more pleased with the company and, and, and the products and the machines. But to these parts, so um, we had a, uh, a, a brilliant engineering firm designed a, a system for sailboats for the Grand Prix of sailboats. This is very high-end, world-class racing sailboats. And this company designed... Um, this system, which is innovative and never, nothing like this had ever been made before. It's a hydraulic system that's computer controlled and it controls virtually every aspect of performance of the boat, everything. And the, the tolerances were, are very, very tight and, um, and everything was new. It hadn't been done before. It was so complex, uh, they, they didn't have the capability to machine it in-house. And um, they were having trouble finding anyone who would take on the job. So they, they found Kyle, they came to us, and and uh, you know, Kyle loves it. The team loves it. They were quickly able to do the programming and, and move from prototype to production, and um, and and the timeline, the deadline was very 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 tight, um, you know, very tight. Well, at the same time, we had a new um, a new uh, Metsura MC520 uh, PC4 machine that had just been set up, and um, it was brand new to us, and Kyle and Matsura, it, 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 we worked together to, to get that machine up and running. This was the first job that was put on that machine, and the deadline and everything was so tight that that machine ran for 147 straight hours. The last part was perfect, just like the first. The system worked. We got everything to the customer in time. They got them into the sailboats in time. Everything worked, and it was perfect. And, you know, we did our end. Kyle did the the, the programming in our machine workers you know the guys did their end but at the end of the day it came down to a brand new untested machine from Matsura that we set up and it knocked it out of the park and um, so that that says a whole lot about the you know the reliability the accuracy and um, and just how the machine works it's an, an excellent excellent machine for the audience watching because that was a lot of information I want you to say that number just one more time because it is so good the Matsura team got that machine into you got it up and running within a, a real short amount of time right a day right. or two I believe right. and then as soon as you push that button go it was how many hours that ran straight without without any interruption or error that machine 
um, the, the MX520 PC4 palletized, that ran for 147 straight hours. We just hit the button and let it rock, keep it loaded. I love it. And we're going to go over to Paul and our buddy Fernando, Fernando in just a minute. But one last thing I want to say, because KCS joining us on camera, we're very grateful for that as well. And Kyle is such an amazing person. I want to give you the opportunity to just let the people out there know if they want to work with KCS, where they can find you. Because you're also putting stuff on the moon, engraving your logo in a boot so you can have your logo on the moon too, right? Well, that's what we'd like to do. We, we uh, similar kind of situation. We um, got a call from a supplier to NASA, uh, NASA for their spacesuits for the Artemis program. And um, we were ha they were having difficulty producing the parts. We were able to get them produced. And um, so we've been now for some time making parts for the new spacesuit, the prototype spacesuits. And so the joke around the shop is that we want to make the boots and put our logo on the bottom. But no, uh, companies can find us uh, www.kcsams.com. And, you know, we're a small company. We work hard. We thrive on challenge. And we're looking for any challenges that companies either can't do or don't want to do and and uh, want a cost effective good smart solution that'll work for them and their success that's what we're there for kcs advanced machining services thank you thank you my friend